The Denver, the Denver Broncos have fired head coach Vic Fangio after three seasons. Denver decided to part ways with Fangio after their 28-24 loss to the Chiefs on Saturday night. The Broncos finished 7-10 and and missed the postseason for the sixth straight season. It was, Vangio, it was Vangio's first head coaching gig after being hired by the Broncos in 2019. He was 61 at the time. The former head coach of the Broncos has been, the, has been an assistant in the NFL for over 30 years. Van Gio was the NFL assistant of the year in 2018 when he was the defensive coordinator for the Chicago Bears. NFL Network's Ian Rappaport and Tom Pelissaro were the first to report the news of the firing. The three-time Super Bowl champions also fired offensive coordinator Pat Shermer and special teams coordinator Tom McMahon. During his time in Denver, Vic Fangio was 19-30. In 2019, the Broncos were 7-9. In 2020, they finished 5-11, and, and this year they were 7-10. After the firing became official, GM George Patton said this about Vic Fangio. I have tremendous respect for Vic and all he's accomplished in the NFL. Over the past year, I appreciate his partnership, friendship, and the tireless work ethic he demonstrated as our head coach. This season, the Broncos traded away franchise icon Von Miller to the Rams. The Broncos have also had 10 different starting quarterbacks since Peyton Manning retired in 2015. Teddy Bridgewater started most of the season for the Broncos and had a good season. His stats were 18 touchdowns, 7 interceptions, 3,052 yards, and a 94.9 passer rating. Although he missed the final three games with a concussion, Drew Locke started for Denver the last three games and lost all of them. Locke threw two touchdowns, two interceptions, 787 yards, and an 80.4 passer rating. The Broncos will most likely draft a quarterback or sign another free agent as Teddy Bridgewater is an unrestricted free agent this offseason. Denver will most likely part ways with Locke this offseason as well. Vic Fangio will most likely be highly sought after for another defensive coordinator gig. Denver's defense got better with Fangio as head coach as they were ranked ninth in total defense and, in, and third in scoring this year. Although Fangio's time is done in Denver, many of his players liked him and respected him as head coach.